When Noe from Iraq's Nineveh Plains returned to his village, Karamlis, in March 2017, the only thing he could recover from his burnt house was 12 marbles from the several hundred in his collection. After three years in a shelter in Abil with his family, following the takeover of Karamlis by Islamic State, Noe had to overcome his distress at the destruction of his childhood home. His family first settled in a relative's house before their own was livable again. The blackened walls are bright and welcoming again. With the help of international aid organisations, Noe's house shook off the rubble and received a new look. The 14-year-old is ready to leave memories of his family's displacement behind. After returning to their restored house in August, Noe kept himself busy by playing football with friends and helping to renovate not just his own but other people's houses as well. Noe's mother, Alma Sleiman, says she misses the old house and what went with it, such as pictures of her children's baptisms. However, her sadness is overcome by the joy of a completely renovated house. With the little money they had, she says they managed, step by step, to buy everything they needed. Noe's father, Haitem Hanna, who writes songs in his spare time, is still busy with the final touches to the house. Noe says he wants to become a footballer and teacher, and he proudly shows off his Barcelona shirt. But above all, he wants his hometown to be safe again, where he hopes to make his dreams come true. <laughs> Yeah.